Hello children today we shall learn about subtraction so what is subtraction let us see what happened in the story the mermaid gave five shells to the fisherman 1 2 3 4 five shells right when the fisherman made a wish for a jug of water for that old man what happened a shell was taken away but he got a jug of water correct so how many shells were left with the fisherman after that 1 2 3 4 yes four shells were left when another wish was made by the fisherman to fill all the rivers and ponds what happened out of the remaining four shells one more shell was taken away so now out of the four shells how many shells were left 1 2 3 yes three shells were left with the fisherman so next from the three shells one shell was again taken away now the fisherman had one two yes two shells next out of the two shells one shell was taken away to fulfill the wish of all farms becoming green and full of crops after all the fisherman was a kind and a helpful man right then how many shells were left with the fisherman only one shell lastly only one shell was left and the fisherman made one more wish remember that last wish with the rain god so when one shell from him was taken away how many shells fisherman had he was left with no shells that is he was left with zero shell so let us see what happened five shells were there one shell was taken away so four shells were left then four shells were there one shell was taken away now three shells were left three shells were there and one more shell was taken away so two shells were left two shells were there one more shell taken away now one shell left and finally when only one shell was left one shell was taken away and nothing that is zero shell left so shells were being taken away from the fisherman and he was left with lesser shells finally he had no shell left but don't feel bad children he had a large number of blessings from all the villagers correct so when things are taken away or become less we call it subtraction subtraction in simple words mean taking away one or more things from what we already have five shells take away one shell is equal to four shells four shells take away one shell is equal to now three shells three shells take away one shell is equal to two shells two shells take away one shell is equal to one shell one shell take away one shell is equal to nothing or zero shell let us write equal to sign instead of writing equal to so five shells take away one shell equal to four shells four shells take away one shell equal to three shells three shells take away one shell equal to two shells two shells take away one shell equal to one shell and one shell take away one shell equal to nothing or zero shell let us take another example bhola at three balloons Oh, look one balloon 
flew away. See how many balloons are left with Bhola now? One, two, yes, yes, only two balloons left. So if three balloons were there and we take away one balloon, then only two balloons are left. So we write three balloon take away one balloon equal to two balloons. As we are subtracting, let us put minus symbol for taking away to show subtraction. So we write three balloon minus one balloon equal to two balloons. So we see three minus one equal to two. Oh, just look there. There are beautiful birds sitting on the tree. Let's count the number of birds sitting there. One, two, three, four and five. There are five birds sitting on the tree. Ooh. Two birds flew away. Now how many birds are left on the tree? One, two, three. So only three birds are left now. 5 birds minus 2 birds equal to 3 birds. We will write it as 5 minus 2 equal to 3. Understood? Let us do the subtraction quickly now. oranges minus one orange equal to one two three three oranges left apples minus four apples how many apples left one two yes two apples Five hats minus three hats equal to one, two, yes, two hats. Six bananas minus three bananas equal to one two three three bananas right children so now you know how to do subtraction take care children and help everyone bye bye